Warning in case of loud. I don't know if loud. No, no sound yet so far. Hey, Crunch, what's up? How are you? We're trying a new game. And it's loading. Hey. It took a while to show up. That was amazing. I did give a warning for obvious reasons. Oh my God, you are, you are loud. Okay. Right. I assume this men means to be sort of background. Yes. Yes, we are trying Potionomics. I was very fortunate to get a key for it because I'd seen people playing it and I wanted to try it. Yeah, so sorry, Crunch. I hope that woke you up. Yeah. <laughs> um, this is, is incredibly loud. Okay, there we go. It's It's there, but less yelling. Okay. <laughs> all good, all good. Okay. I'll fiddle with the sound and stuff if I need to later. It's all good. I think all of this was fine. It's put me straight on like... Can you hear that? The scrolling noise? Um, -ba -dum -ba -dum. Uh, max FPS 60, that's fine. I don't want it like unlimited. Because that's how you lose your frames. Um, might put stuff on high for now. I don't know how good it is I'll leave it on epic I guess it's auto detected and it's fine okay that seems fine yeah I'm good thank you I'm good how's your Monday going I know you've probably only just woken up but still all right let's try it I'm scared oh while haggling pay attention to what your customers are thinking okay I love I love tips in a loading screen that's how I learn. Oh, we've got a rumble. Is there voice acting on my reading? My dearest Sylvia. Greetings from Rafter. It's here on this charming island that I'll build my potion shop, fulfilling my lifelong dream. I hope that one day you'll be able to see it. Among the very first to set foot on the island, since the witch queen fell in battle, her unsanctioned experiments made this a land like no other. Who knows what riches await me? I very much doubt you're gonna get riches, mate. Love to your mother. Tell your father he still owes me money, your uncle Oswald. Oh, I love this already. It's so cute. Dearest niece, thank you for sending me your potion. Sadly, it must have spoiled in transit. Unless you meant for it to taste like old cabbage. Oh my god. <laughs> anyway, keep at it. It warms my heart to think you might follow in your old uncle's footsteps. So this is going to be like Stardew get a farm from grandpa. This is going to be a get potion shop from uncle. I like it. After months of paperwork and months of construction, my potion shop is finally a reality. We have now doors tomorrow. Wish me luck. Although, what could go wrong? I wonder. Thanks, Oswald. Sylvia, if you're reasoning this, it means I'm dead, which isn't great. I, he was the coolest uncle, clearly. More to the point, it means I've died without an heir. I implore you, Sylvia, don't let this be the end of my shop. My dream! <laughs> Come to Rafter, accept your inheritance, and show this town what our family is capable of achieving. Okay. Oh, wow. Sylvia, please accept our firm's condolences for the recent loss of your relation, Oswald. For the terms of his will, you are the lawful recipient of his property on the island of Rafter. However, given the island's remote location and an unusual history, such an inheritance must be claimed in person or else will be deemed forfeit. Oh well, guess we'll have to go to the potion shop. We hope this inheritance offers some comfort in your time of mourning. Ah, it doesn't fix anything, but okay. Yeah, look at the animation for this. The design for this, it's, it's really interesting art styles. Considering the significant sums your uncle borrowed from our establishment is certain to be an impressive piece of property. <gasps> And it's not, is this it? She's got a big bag, so I assume this is her in the in the shop. Feeling overwhelmed when brewing. I didn't see that. Okay, this place is not all I hoped for. Oh, bless her. I love this. This could still work. I can make this work. I just need to air it out a bit. Oh, she's so cute. I love her hair. Good thing I've got a broom. Okay. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Oh, you can't see how cool her hair is because I'm in front of it. Forgive me for the intrusion. 
Hello. I wasn't expecting to have the opportunity to act on Oswald's will so soon. I'm Helena. And you're Sylvia, right? We have some business to discuss. But first, I should offer my condolences on the loss of your uncle. Thank you. I didn't know him that well, though. All the same, it's a pity, particularly since he left behind such a substantial debt. Oopsie. As a designated heir, responsibility for that debt now falls to you. She's come to collect, probably. I didn't know that's how it worked, but I guess that's fine. Oh, would you like to pay the full balance of one million gold now? Pardon? I love this. It looks so good. Hang on, let me move myself there. Now I'm above the dialogue, but you can see her face and her hair. I take it you prefer to set up a payment plan? If I need to move my camera around, it's fine, I don't know. You could build five shops with that much gold. What did he do with all of it? Mismanaged it to judge by appearances. Ouch! Ma'am? I have his contract right here if you'd like to look it over. Fine print is very fine. <laughs> What did you just do? Invoked a soul binding which transfers his rights and obligations onto you. Make your payment on time and this shop is yours. Okay, this is the kind of Stardew Animal Crossing, but with a potion shop. I like, I like. If you fought on the loan, however, and you forfeit the property. And also there's, what was the one like this? Oh, the weapons shop. Um, Holy Potatoes weapons shop. Yeah. That sounds bad. <laughs> Confident that you have everything you need to succeed. In fact, here. I'll get you started. Oh, she gave us a moldy potion. <laughs> okay. So this is where it's deck building. Oh, I'm actually in an okay place for this. Okay. Attempt to raise her interest in the potion. Flail in your attempt to raise her interest in the potion. Blunder your way through an attempt to raise her interest in... Okay. Okay. How do I what? I give it to her basically. It's a potion. So I guess you have to keep trying. Because it's new tutorial. Okay. Minimally interested. <laughs> okay. I love it. The stress is getting to me. Sylvia. Oh, it's like giving you really bad stuff and it says end your turn because all your cards are bad. Oh no! Too stressed to function. I'm so sorry, Sylvia. Well, I trust you'll get the hang of it. You have a full 10 days before your first payment is due. No! <laughs> okay, bye. Oh, look, she's just... Oh. <laughs> I never should have come here. What am I going to do? Oh, shit. Um, who or what is that? It's got a hat on. It's an owl! Let me see his little face. Oh, <gasps> hello. He's the thing giving you tips in the uh, loading screen. I mean, hoot, hoot. He's like, I swear I don't talk. Well, yeah, okay. He's got a little, little necklace on as well. You must be new here. This is Rafter, where the strange is commonplace and the birds are chatty. <laughs> What property law is like in Rafter? Because I'm pretty sure you're trespassing. <laughs> I live here. No, you don't. I mean, yeah, you were like, stowaway. You live here in the shop. I didn't know Uncle Oswald had a pet. He's gonna be like, I'm not a pet. I'm. Did he never mention me? How strange. I. Integra, I was to his shop. What? I was the brains of his whole. I'm not being conned by you, you stupid talking owl. My name is Owl. That's a shit name for an owl. First idea, best idea kind of guy. It's nice meeting you and all, but I'm getting on the first boat out of here. No, 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 no. So what happened? That lawyer's soul binding means she'll be able to track you to the ends of the globe. Miss a single payment, you'll find yourself toiling away for untold years, change to a cubicle, until you've worked off your debt. There's no way I can make enough by telling, selling potions. I love her, just her character. She's so cute. Maybe not through the traditional route, but you've arrived at a fortuitous time. There are five competitions taking place over the next 50 days. A series of contests in which local merchants will go head-to-head -head in tournaments of artistry and salesmanship. I have information right here. 
Initial prize money. Oh, of course. A few specific potions in advance. Those are what you'll be judged on. And when the first one, you'll automatically qualify for the next one. Okay. Grand prize. Woo. You really think I've got a shot at this? I'm worried I'm going to be terrible. It's really your only hope. Why would you say that? I know a thing or two. I don't know that you do. I think you're bluffing, small owl. Sprues and potions. Let's do some potion or mix. Oh boy. <laughs> Grading your shop for plan will help you so more. I'm I'm excited for like the shop management type stuff. That's my favorite part. There's a lot in here, but shop management I like. Okay. Potion a day keeps the healer away one day. New study has highlighted the benefits of daily health potion use in shoring up the body's natural defenses, so like vitamins. Increased value for health potions. Oh my god. I don't want to be crap. <laughs> I see you clean up the place a bit. Nicely done. Now the real work can begin. We need to craft some potions. Okay, I can do it. Let's head over to the cauldron and get brewing. Is this the cauldron? Okay. So. I don't need to go. Yeah, okay. Access cauldron. Oh. Handful of ingredients behind. We'll have to make do with those for now. Okay. Assume you know your way around a cauldron. You went to school for this after all. Did I? Oh my god. I learned how to make pretty much any potion you can think of. There's just one problem. I'm not fully licensed yet. Oopsie. Don't blame me. The regulations are intense. I have to prove I can handle the basic stuff before they'll let me brew more advanced potions. See? To get the next one, I have to put in a lot of hours at the cauldron. Okay. Okay. You will certainly get your hours. Let's go! <laughs> Better go with my notes from college just to be safe. Minimum of two different magic infused ingredients to be combined in heating in the cauldron. Every ingredient contains one or more color coded and letter assigned magimins? Where would we be without it? Like a vitamin. A magimin. A magic vitamin. Wherever magic has left its mark on the world, you'll find magimins. Okay. Farming for stuff? Farming for stuff. Heating an ingredient releases the magimins with contained within it. Okay. Potion specific recipe is best thought of a so it's a recipe. It's a recipe. Yeah. The ingredient is only the vessel. Magimins they contain will determine what kind of potion is created. All right, I'm understanding. Okay, ratios are important. If your balance of magimins is out of whack, the resulting potion will be less valuable. I hope this isn't too hard, because I'm not right. Okay, one step at a time. Got to put ingredients in the cauldron to make a potion. Duh. Okay. Can't go wrong with health potions. I have that recipe memorized. Red and green. Fair berries and magic root should do the trick. Okay. Do I drag? No. What? How? How do I? Do I need a bottle? What am I doing? Oh, there's these as well. Okay. Yeah, so that's the health one. What do I do with it? Where do I put it? Where am I putting it? Okay. That's what I did the first time. So confused. The balance is perfect. Should I do one of each then? Like... I mean, two of each. Balance. Okay. Let's get the lid on and set it to brew. Okay. That's it. Nothing left to do here but let it cook. Okay. Okay, so you leave it brewing and you go back. Okay. So you want a higher quality because then they sell for more money. Yeah. Your potion should be ready in the afternoon. Okay, I can see it brewing over here. Look how cute this is. I have some old ones. Let's go ahead and arrange them on the shelves. Yes! This is what I want to do. So three health potions. 
Arrange potions. Ah! They won't set the world on fire, but nothing else. Selling them will be a good practice for you. I'm on the shelf. Once that's done, they'll be available for sale when we open the shop. Okay. Cool. We'll see what you have available for purchase. Yeah. The shelf on which you put a potion will have an effect on the potion's value. Well, I only have one shelf right now. Obviously, we unlock the others later. Sure. So you're a chemist. I'm an alchemist. Bitch. <laughs> okay. So we'll get to make more shelves and yeah. Okay. Ah. Open shop. Good traits increase a potion's price by 5%. Ooh. I like the two kinds of style. Alchemist. Oh, yes. Yes. Exactly. Um, okay, hopefully this goes better than yesterday. It will. It has to. Just keep the basics in mind and you'll be fine. Haggling. No, I'm bad at haggling. <laughs> I'm good at laying out a shop. I'm going to be bad at haggling. Now to raise each customer's interest, the higher the interest, the more they'll pay. Patience. Okay. Okay. What's my transmitter? How? Look. Yeah, shut up. You never know. There might be one. We only just started. Okay. So don't, basically don't, like, spend too long haggling or they'll just get pissed off and leave. Right. Don't let them stress you out. Great. The reason I don't work in retail. This is the reason. People. People. Okay. Hi. Peppy commoner. That's such a weird thing to say. Let's talk money. Should start by setting them up for my sales pitch. Okay. So it's teaching. So you use the cards for haggling. That's genius. I can reel them in. Okay. This is okay. I like it. Brace myself for their turn. Oh, come on then. Gain two shield. This is clever. Okay, let's see what she has to say. Thought the potions would be super cheap. Need a vacation. <laughs> She's stressed. Sylvia, no. Good thing I have my guard up. Otherwise, I'd be stressed. Okay. Let's just close it out. Okay. All right, okay. So the haggling is the card stuff. That, yeah, I can get into it. It's got a formula, you know, can I help you? Friendly artisan. I ran into a hero who had the nicest thing to say about this shop. This one looks nice. What are you asking for it? Okay, so we have to do the same thing as before. So I've only got those two anyway. Go for it. Nice! I like it. Starting off really simple. Thanks for your business. Oh, she's doing so well. Gloomy craftsman. I can't believe people get up this early. I love that. Probably more than I want to spend. Ah, oh, so we only have these anyway. All right. It's not the worst I've seen. Okay. All right. Get in there. Come back soon. That's all of them for now. That didn't go so badly. It's clear your haggling skills are already improving. Could I offer a small suggestion? Sometimes the best move to make is the move you haven't thought about yet. When you don't like your options, take a moment and scheme your way to a better path. Scheme is a new card. Okay. I get it. I look forward to seeing it in action. That's enough of a break for now. That was a break. Wow. Potions brew an extra two time slots overnight. Nice. This health potion should be done brewing. Let's take a look. I like this. It's really cute. Yeah. Let's check the cauldron. Yeah, I mean, obviously I've only done a little bit, but it, it's... It's like fun and... Like, simple while still being like, I feel like I'm doing something, you know? Let's bottle them up. Do I... Do I... Do I click it or do I just press it? Okay. Fine. 
Yeah, first batch done. Why not make some more for the night shift? Diversify your offerings though, you never know what will be in demand. Mana potions require green and yellow. Okay. Those are both green, but all right, I'll take it. That is yellow, apparently. Sure. Mana potions take a little longer to brew than health potions, so let's pump up the heat to speed up the process. Fuel. Okay. So you got to boost it with some fuel. Your feet. Oh, it's like a little calcifer. Yeah, this is fun and funky. <laughs> different types of fuel from different areas of the island. Not all fuel is created equal. There's a little bit of hay left. Go ahead and feed it into the fire. Ah, I will. Down here, interesting. All right. And then brew it. Okay, let's go. Open the shop for the afternoon to sell the health potions you brewed this morning. Let's do it. Some shelves have unique sales bonuses. Interesting. Let's take a moment to think about your haggling strategy. Look, you leave my haggling strategy out of this. Okay. Oh, deck building. Yeah, here are cards on this page. These are the haggling skills you have to begin with. Head over to my page to see the new haggling tip I taught you. Hello, Mr. Owl. New haggle techniques will appear here as you learn them. Okay. You have to make space for them. Mouse over any card in the deck and press the minus button to remove it, and then you can click and add something else. Fine, he gave me two of those. Right, so... Hmm. I mean, these are all good. So are those actually spaces? So I have... Oh, I have loads of each. Okay. Let's add one of those in. I want to see how we use it, to be honest. Okay. Do I have to arrange them? I should. A little more expensive that's good and then I just open it okay I hope so. used to buy from your uncle I see talent runs in the family okay all right let's see what we've got Kinda interested. Okay, do an end turn and see what they do. Cards in your draw pile. Can I? Let's keep this a little rough. Like my nephew's crayon drawings. Ouchies. I'm gonna have to get used to how to do this. Okay. Bopping to the music. Good. Yeah. Right. Let's go with that. Should I do it? That's not bad. Can she gain even more shield? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. I can just close it. Awesome. Okay. Maybe I didn't need to use that last one. But... Hope the natural light isn't bad for the potions. God. Okay. Yeah, the music is really cute too. Okay. Alright. Good with this. You chose a good one. Let's do the old uh, scheme. Oh, draw three cards. Nice. Damn.
Oh no, did I use too many cards? No! Oh, they ran out of patience. Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the patients. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> There's a lot of variables with that. Okay, don't forget the mana potions. All right. There's still time to sell them before the day's over. Okay. Let's bot them up. Alrighty. Let's go. This is really nice. I like it. Nice. Sell these for the last block of the day. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, God. All right. And then this is a fiery thingy. Okay. Let's do it. So you put the long ones to go on overnight. That makes sense. Okay. Um, all right. Got to arrange me potions. If I sell that as well, that'd be great. Okay, let's see if I can get better at this. Sylvia, come on. Oh, she's just got shield. If in hand at the end of the turn increases the stress by one. No. It'll increase her stress. No, you can't, like, get rid of it. Oh, no. Now you got some padding in that price. Ouch. Okay. I'm looking at their patience now. Um... In. Bring them in. Okay. That's it. Close it. Yes. Yes. She did it. Yes. Perfect. Okay. Meredith, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Okay. What have we got here? Patience is a 10, that's fine. God protected against the extra stress. Oh, thank you. I'm I'm learning, I'm getting there. Okay, let's do that. Don't wanna close it yet. Don't wanna discard, mm, okay. <laughs> Selling one can of stew had it in my cupboard for over a month, guaranteed to last longer than most English political figureheads. True, you are not wrong. Okay. We need to get some level of interest. Oh dear. Thank you so much, everyone, for helping. Thank you, Miss Dora, for the tip. Um right. She doesn't have much. Okay, I'm gonna have to do that. Okay, not bad, not bad. I was like, otherwise we'll get nothing because the patients will go too far down. Four. It's cute though, I love this. God, daily auto save. Damn, I hadn't thought about saving yet. What is he doing? What's the big idea? The shop was already here. Don't give me that. Don't give me that. I live here. Are you invoking squatters' rights? Are you joking? Been kicking back in this trash heap for weeks now. Didn't clean up that weird looking mildew in the corner, did you? I was saving that for later. What is wrong with you? I think there's been a mistake. I... We just inherited this. Just when you're sure you know a condemned building when you see it. Nope. Obviously some kind of potions witch, I guess. As it happens, I've got a semi-legitimate business selling all sorts of magical ingredients. Okay, so she's our supplier now. Fine. She 
can kick some business my way. Sure. Definitely got any ingredients. Sure, we have a friend. Quinn. Hi, Quinn. Call that move planting the seed. Feel free to use it in your own hustle. New card. I love the design on that. That's cool. Okay, I like that one. I think I will use that. Where can I find your shop? It's hard to miss. Just go outside and look up. Look forward to doing business. Sure. Let's go for it. I, yeah. See you around then. All right. Unless that weird mildew gets you first. Mm, okay. Aww. So this was my day one. Alright. Customers eight, potion sold six. Yeah. <laughs> okay. 